Welcome to the video. The gang's all here. We're doing some late night cleanup before we hit the hay here. Uh, this was the dumpster dive find today. The mean one was working and she threw out tons of clothes and <clears throat> shoes, jeans, everything. And of course, I I don't have any where to, how to, I don't, I just don't deal with that. That'll be gone by the morning from the nighttime divers. So I did pick out a few things. She did not throw out any uh, jewelry that I could find unless it was underneath this, you know, deflated waterbed mattress. And some of y'all know how heavy that's going to be. So I didn't mess with that. So we got some Crayola, little Crayola matte pencils. They're not much left of them, but they're nice colors. I can get that to a little kid or something. I got me a little car to add to my collection. I'm going to have to clean it up a little bit. But the doors come open. It's made in Hong Kong, so that's, that's a vintage one. I like it. Probably shouldn't open that door. Hmm. The Z300ZX. We remember those, or 2X or something. Cool. Love it. Vintage pencil. I'm, I'm getting a lot together of vintage office stuff. USA titanium. It's in good condition. We had this elephant. Probably, I don't know if it's hand carved or not, and it sat on top of something like maybe a cane this is like a I'm not sure something around or I don't know what do y'all think decorated the top of something uh, a Pez don't really know. Made in Hungary. Is that unusual? I don't know. I don't know anything about Pez. I need to look that up. And I don't know who this, you know, what this is. 2000 Pez. Cool. He's picking up the facial recognition or something on the video. Um, is this Mario? I'm not sure. Super Mario, Nintendo, McDonald's, 2017. And then, these are all the same. They're not chipped. And they were donated by a booth, booth 10, and now that I think about it, a, a whole antique mall went out of business. Uh, I used to talk to the lady, and I don't know. She always wanted me to, you know, get, get a spot. But um, this is no bull. I need to look these up. If y'all are up late tonight and you can't sleep, I could use some help. No bull, Winston. Nothing but taste. Glass ashtray. Good condition. One, two, three, four, five of them. Remember how I was telling y'all I actually paid for some ashtrays. So now they're kind of coming to me. Then we have this. Somebody wanted a dollar at a garage sale, but get this. Can y'all see what it says? Paula and Ricky, August 13th, 1988. And it's NASCO. There's another one. So two engraved pieces. I don't know if people want engraved pieces. Probably not. Silver plate. But 
at least it has a date on it. That's kind of cool. This is a our favorite word on a ruler. Yeah, I was surprised. I guess it's made in the USA. I don't know. Check that out. Probably another vintage office supply. It's a little bit dusty, so I need to clean that up. And I like this a lot. It's a little plate, but look at this. That's like the scientific name and then fish and lalum. It's um, some kind of lily. Henrietta porcelain collection. Oh, that's pretty. And then we have this one is like a raspberry with a raspberry flower. And, oh, she had a bunch of stuff in there. I couldn't, you know, I was just looking for jewelry. American Athlier at Home, Berry Patch, Porcelain. And then this one's not in very good condition. I'll probably just put it out at the bottle. Recycle, Poppy Trail, Metlocks, Made in California. And then the last thing is a, I was going to scrap it, but um, it's not aluminum. It's just sticks to a magnet. It's a cookie tray. It's huge, so I'm not going to be able to get it all in frame. But look, it's a Wilton. Of course, you look it up and they're still making those at Walmart, but that just looks vintage to me. I guess I do need to show y'all. So I'm going to pull this up. Here comes Mika. Mika, did you hear me in here rattling around? We still have that box of files over there. So it says this number here with the size and this is it. Look how big it is. It's huge. Like industrial size. Um, but ovens were big back, you know, ovens were big. And then, like I said, this is the writing so it looks, whoops, it's looking vintage to me. It's raised. And it's in good condition. I mean, it's not bad. It's really solid and thick. So, um, that's what we got today. Just wanted to let y'all know because I'm going to process it. So, if y'all can help me out with any of the details on uh, maybe some of the research, any of you insomniacs, I'd appreciate it. Thank you very much. See y'all next time.